everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Armour with the Stock Swish and Reviewing Apple. What an amazing move the stock has made after the earnings, which is very interesting because if you looked at the earnings, and I talked about this on Cheddar TV last week, she wouldn't even be able to tell it was really an earnings trade. But the fact is I did call a bunch of options trades. I felt that it was not a good day trade, but a better overnight, and it has turned out to be that and I've lost track of how many trades I've called in this actually in the two days. So this is definitely headed up, went to all of the targets, the dream targets, 250, 252, 255, 260, it almost got to. But I mean, again, if you're still in this, I think you're chancing it for the people that did the Apple calls that I called, which was so many. It's very important to book money in this market. It's just important to book money all the time, no matter what, anyways. And I've been calling so many trades on the options newsletter subscription that it just doesn't make sense not to book profits because if I'm calling a lot of trades, nine times out of 10, you book the money, take a trade on a Friday, get out on a Monday, I'm gonna call another trade. Take a trade on a Friday, get out on a Friday, I'm gonna call another trade. So it just book the money because you never know what's gonna happen. I like this, I think this morning was a great exit This in this. If, if anybody's still in this or any one of the many trades that I've called, you really, you really have 100% conviction that this is higher between now and the end of the week. But again, looking at the market, you know, I mean, we're strong. We hit up over 200 and again, there was another number in the queues. But you know, how, how far will we go from here? Will we go straight up? That remains to be seen. Even one thing could create some kind of sell off in this market. I don't think it lasts long, but it could happen. And again, you have to book money. You trade, if you trade, if you're an active trader, if you're an options trader, if you're a day trader, the reason that you trade is to make money. You don't have the money in your account until the fat lady sings and you're out of the trade. Looking at it in your P&L doesn't mean it's yours until you exit the trade. Beautiful trades I've called in here. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And we'll just, we'll see where Apple goes. I'm sure some people are still in this. I mean, it looks like it's gonna get to 260. But, I mean, it's gonna get to 260, but will it happen between today and tomorrow? I don't know, but all these trades are profitable, really nice calls, and um, we'll see where we go. If you're interested in the Gap Options newsletter, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. It's $5,999 a year, and so, so well worth it. Um, again, I've lost track of how many trades I've called between just Friday and today, but they're, they all worked. They all worked, and it's 309 here. This is, this, this is gonna try to run up to, to 260 today, wow. I mean, Apple's, Apple's lifting the market. That Apple's lifting the market. Yeah, that's what's happening here. All right, have a great week, everyone. If you're interested in learning the method, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Only two more classes between now and the end of the year. The November class is November 16th and 17th. Have a great day.